Okay, so as I'm doing all this, I decided I want to add a couple of reflection moments as we go along. Now, these are things you can really skip through if you don't want to hear the reflection moments. But on these reflection moments, it's just to talk about and comment a little bit more about what's going on here and, and why it's worth doing this. So I want you to think about this. Turmeric by itself. If you look at turmeric, if you just Google benefits of turmeric, uh, health benefits of turmeric, you'll find easily 15 to 20 to 30 things uh, just telling you how healthy and how good turmeric is for you. And the same thing is with ginger by itself and the same thing with hibiscus tea by itself, you know, and then also uh, uh, kombucha all by itself. And then also, you know, the high vitamin C content in, in, in lemons and, you know, and so and then also apples and, and all the vitamins and the apples contain and just how, you know, like they say an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Of course, we know that's just the same, but it, it's talking about that it does have health benefits to it. So anyway, so just these things by themselves are healthy. And even green tea by itself is, is an antioxidant and is healthy for you. And honey by itself also helps, especially if it's homegrown honey, I, it, it will contain uh, certain pollens and, and things that will help you to fight off uh, different you know, viruses and, and, and things that are in your area. And so, so all these things by themselves are antioxidants and, and help fight against uh, sickness and viruses and things like that. And so what we're doing, we are creating like a super drink here. These are almost like uh, going to a health store and getting one of those, I don't know, they're called super shots or something where you just get a little drink of juice or something that's just packed full of different nutrients that can help your body and, you know, and just be beneficial to your health. And so by making this kombucha, especially what we're doing, this extreme kombucha and fermentation and, and all these healthy, yummy uh, fruits in here and roots in here, we're really making a super strong, potent, uh, healthy drink for ourselves. Okay. And not only are we making A, we're, by the time we do this, this is, um, this is going to be at least three to four, almost four gallons, well, three and a half gallons of, um, of, of kombucha. And so, and that's, uh, again, how many of that, it's like in, in ounces, it's a lot of ounces. It's, uh, what is it? It's three gallons. Three gallons. Let's say three gallons. <laughs> I'm putting my wife on the spot here. Yeah, so, so anyway, she's figuring that out. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to, I'm going to go back to, I'm going to show you. So here we got, oops, just a little oopsie there. Um, here I want to show you the the pulp from from the juice uh, from the juicer. It's how much? So that's 384 ounces of of kombucha that's just packed full. And so, and I usually put them in, you know, anywhere from 10 ounce bottles to my largest bottle I would use is like a 64 ounce bottle. But I mainly would drink. Uh, probably in one day, I probably drank about 20 ounces total, maybe in one day. And so, you know, with that many uh, ounces, almost, almost, almost 400 uh, ounces, because it's actually going to be a little bit over three gallons. So almost 400 ounces, you know, and drinking like 20 ounces a day. That's that's uh, that's 20 days that just from this time we're spending right now, and with these ingredients that we are really helping ourselves you know, in our health benefits. And so, and you can see all this, this bulky stuff right here. Now, actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I think I'm gonna save all of this. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna boil it and I'm gonna try making a crazy, not a ginger beer, but like it's something like a ginger beer uh, from all this pulp. So this has apple in it, it has lemon in it, it has almost a pound of ginger in it and it has turmeric in it and so yeah i'm gonna save it and actually make a make a boil it down with some cardamom and some cloves uh and maybe one or two peppercorns in there as well with about six quarts of water so a gallon and a half of water and i'm gonna make some on my next video uh series i'm gonna make some some ginger uh some apple ginger 
lemon beer from this. And I think it's gonna be delicious. Okay, so we're gonna save this actually. All right, so we're gonna continue on uh, with the next stage. So hope you like this reflection.